Digital Romance TV. Hey, it's Michael Fiore from DigitalRomance.tv along with Nora. Hello. And today's video is called... The Five Signs You Shouldn't Marry Her. Five Signs You Should Not Marry Her. Sign number one is she has a tentacle growing from her forehead. Well, if that's what turns you on. It might turn you on. Actually, forget that one. Um, we actually thought about these five things quite a bit. Came up with a list that I think is pretty darn good. Yeah. So what was our number one here? Uh, if she won't sign a prenup. If she won't sign a prenup. We did a video about prenups before. And we're going to get... Uh, we're going to get the comments down yeah. here. Like, what? No, a prenup means there's no love. Blah, blah, blah. Totally disagree. If there is love, then signing a prenup is no big deal. If you firmly believe the relationship is going to last, then what's the big deal? You should about watch our other video, the top three reasons why you should get a prenup. We've got a whole video about that. But you can rant here, or you could actually <laughs> go do your, or you could go do your research and see why we are so passionately in the pro prenup, pro prenup corner. So, but if she refuses to sign a prenup, That's really hard to say. Don't even even if she has way more money than you, if she refuses to sign a prenup, don't get married. Next. History of cheating. History of cheating. Um, as we said in the previous video, once a cheater, not always a cheater, but uh, 10 times a cheater, yeah, she's going to cheat I'd a say lot. even five times, five if it's times with five separate relationships, yeah. yeah. Um, somebody who is not built for monogamy should not be entering into a monogamous relationship. Unless quote, unquote, that's what you guys decide, but then that's something that you discuss. And then you're swingers, yeah. Number three? Uh, if she's demeaning or belittling. Mm -hmm. um, if she's being kind of bitchy to you now, she's going to be in the future. By the way, this goes the other way as well. But, uh, it means, I mean, that really comes down to she's she is not in love with you no. specifically. She's trying to change you. Or you're fitting a role at that right, point. Right, exactly. That. If, you feel, if you feel like she doesn't want to marry who you are as a person, but more just wants you to get married, that's yes. not a good reason to get, ma get, get married. And it means she's basically just trying to force you to fit a suit in some sort of way yeah. that is not you. Number four? Uh, she's entitled. If she's entitled and that she feels like that just being pretty or being a woman means that you have to give her everything in her life. Don't do it. As at least in the modern day, marriage is a partnership. It should go both ways. And finally, the biggest one, which I think is the most important, uh, which is... Being in love with the... Um, in love with Prince Charming. Yeah. In love with the fantasy. We do get this a lot in our uh, when we do advice for women, where women, a lot of women seem to feel like they have been waiting for Prince Charming since they were a little girl and he never showed up. And a lot of women find themselves meeting guys who are perfectly good guys and then find themselves trying to mold that guy into the perfect man. But um, I'm not perfect. I really don't. You are either. And if you feel like a woman is constantly comparing you to a guy that doesn't exist, it's not going to get better, by the way. No. The reason to get married is because you feel a connection to a person and you feel like she's going to be a great partner, hopefully for life, right? Uh, life is a long time. 20 years is a long time. 30 years is even longer. So if you're going to do that, you need to understand that you're going to be with somebody who is hopefully reasonable. And love isn't always enough. You have to like the person too. So there you go. There's our five reasons not to get married. Yeah. You shouldn't marry her. Her. Oh, you can get married to somebody else. That's right. Funny. But just not her. Uh, if you want more, go to digitalromance.tv and please subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you've got a cell phone in your pocket or purse right now, then you've got everything you need to create incredible romance and passion with the man or woman in your life at the push of a button. Go to digitalromance.tv forward slash TRB to see Michael Fiore make an entire audience of women on The Rachel Ray Show swoon and learn how to use tiny little text messages to have the relationship of your dreams.